trabajar en estos edificios en Vancouver y también en lugares como Intel que están luchando por buenos empleos. ganancias récord están diciendo que tienen que bajar los sueldos de los janitors. ¿Es eso justo? Y con la necesidad de proveer para su familia. 
In many cases, in many cases, these congregation members are also workers like us, who are also struggling for the same for the same reasons we are, because of low wages, and they're fighting to provide for their families and make ends meet. <laughs> Esos líderes son quienes ofrecen a los trabajadores un rayo de esperanza. It is these faith leaders who lead by example, who are offering us a ray of hope. And with us today are Reverend Jack Monsucker, Reverend Bob Kruger, Monsignor Chuck Liner, Reverend Cecil Prescott, and there are many more in our community who go with them. And also with us are Reverend Lynn Smouse Lopez and Reverend Jean Ross. Not only do I value and admire 
for the work that you do in my office and in our building, but I admire you for being here today and standing up for what's right in our community. Good job! sino que también admiro el trabajo que están haciendo para luchar por buenos empleos, que es la meta de todos nosotros. So every year that I've been an elected official, I have attended these events because what you fight for is what Portland needs more of. Good jobs, fair wages, good contracts. Thank you. Yo he sido líder elegido, yo siempre he asistido a estos actos públicos porque yo apoyo lo que estamos pidiendo hoy, son buenos trabajos, buenos contratos y justicia en nuestra ciudad. So my family knows firsthand what it means to be a janitor in the city of Portland. Some of you heard me in previous gatherings of this nature. My grandma, great-grandmother immigrated from Galway, Ireland and worked as a janitor in this city for 17 years. Yo, yo sé algo de lo que significa trabajar como janitor en la limpieza en esta ciudad por la experiencia de mi propia familia. Algunos de ustedes habrán me, me, han, me habrán escuchado en otros actos públicos como este que mi bisabuela vino de, de Galway, Irlanda Soon I will be retiring and entering my golden years, no longer serving you as mayor. And uh, we have two great candidates that are running here today. It's great to see them here. I'm sure they will continue the tradition of being a partner in fighting for justice for janitors. As mayor, it has been a great honor and a pleasure to work with a leader at Multnomah County that is passionate on these issues and put, puts that passion into practice and policies for Multnomah County. It is now my honor to introduce Multnomah County Chair Jeff Kogan. <laughs> Hello. I'm so happy to be with you all once again, standing for our local janitors. As county chair, I'm deeply supportive of any effort that builds a healthier community. When families can afford the cost of living, we have a healthier community. When workers have a voice on their job, we have a healthier community. When people can go to the doctor when they're sick without having to worry about cutting their food budget, we have a healthier community. Today is about our local janitors, the ones who have fought and won these benefits, and the ones who don't yet have them. Today is about letting our community know that when workers can take care of themselves and their families, we're all better off. And today we're making sure that everyone Building owners, industry leaders, community leaders, hear it loud and clear. Estos son valores importantes y hoy queremos asegurarnos de que todos los dueños de los edificios, los líderes de los de los de las grandes empresas, nos escuchen y comprendan. That's why today. 
Mayor Adams and I are releasing an open letter to contractors and building owners in our community, yeah. clearly stating that these are our values. Yeah. Por eso que hoy el alcalde Tamar y yo estamos anunciando una carta pública diciendo que es eh, esta, una carta pública a los dueños de, de las compañías de limpieza y, los, y de los edificios declarando que estos, estos son valores de nuestra comunidad de buenos empleos. Stand with the workers in our community for affordable health care, living wages, and paid sick days off. I want to end by asking you the question, can we make this the country we all know it should be? So we're going to be marching two by two, that's in double file lines, out that side of Terry Strong Plaza.